Good afternoon. Today, an indictment. Special counsel Jack Smith has asked the United States Supreme Court to weigh in on the question of whether former President Donald Trump is immune from prosecution in the federal case charging him with plotting to overturn the 2020 presidential election. This is a legally untested question. There's nothing in the Constitution or the case law that talks about whether a former president can be charged. And so the special counsel's office wants an expedited rapid determination from the Supreme Court, the highest court in the land, to determine once and for all that in fact a former president is not exempt from prosecution and that there are situations in which a former commander in chief can in fact be indicted and can in fact um, be put on trial. All the parties here are operating on a ticking clock. The trial is scheduled to start next March, but of course the presidential election is also scheduled for the fall of 2024. In a desire to resolve these questions once and for all, and have a final say from the top court in the land, Jack Smith decided to go right straight ahead to the Supreme Court to make sure there was no ambiguity and no second guessing. And that's not normally the way the process would work. Normally you would ask the DC appeals court, the circuit court here um, for that. And uh, so now we're at, he's asking the Supreme Court instead. it would be unusual. And in fact, there's really not much time for the Supreme Court to add a new case to the docket and to decide it under the time frame that Jack Smith wants. So this is really unclear exactly what's going to happen. But in order to hedge his bet, Jack Smith is also simultaneously asking for the appeals court to expedite um, taking up this issue too uh, in the event that the Supreme Court does not 